What's up guys? It is now 2020 and if you guys have been following me for this past year, you guys will know that at the start of 2019 I made it a weekly goal to make one video a week and it's the start of a new year and I've uploaded one video every week for every week of 2019 and some weeks have been harder to upload because either I didn't have ideas or I was busy but it was an actual goal to make weekly vlogs no matter how busy or how tired that I was and I'm going to show you a list of the goals that I made for 2019 right here right here there's gonna be a list of the goals that I made for 2019 and as you will see some of them are checked and some of them are not and the number one goal that I made for 2019 was to make weekly vlogs one one every week and it's checked off I did it the second one is the second goal was to go full-time at the tattoo shop that I was doing photo and video for and it, as you see it says half a check and the reason I say half a check was because I did go full-time for about four four or five months but I quickly found out that it wasn't the right position for me just because some of the duties that I needed to do and what they asked for of me and it wasn't a good fit for me so I went back to my welding job because I posted a video of this in case you guys didn't see it I did get laid off from my day job but at that time I was doing photo and video and then my welding job called me back so I went back and I told the tattoo studio that I it wasn't the right fit so I left number three was to be more outgoing and I failed at that I'm horrible at talking to people I have social anxiety and it's hard for me to talk to new people so yeah I failed that and number four was to skate more and since I wasn't doing both my day job and the tattoo shop I had more time to skate so I made it a goal to skate and I was actually able to skate two days a week for almost every week of the summer and yeah I had a lot of fun skating it was mainly me skating with my friend Anthony and it was a lot of fun he's been in a, one of my videos before a couple of them actually but yeah I got to skate more and skateboarding was one of my favorite hobbies and I'm still very passionate about it number five was to finish the book that I've been writing for years and I didn't finish it but I do have a couple of the chapters I guess finished but I haven't finished it yet and I hope to finish it soon I didn't make that a goal for 2020 but it is a goal of mine to finish it eventually and post content four to five times a day every day didn't do that it's actually kind of hard for me to post four to five times a day just because of my day job but i didn't take a lot of photos or videos that i really liked enough to post four to five times a day so i didn't really do that but hopefully eventually i'll i'm content with posting once or twice a day honestly some days i don't even post but i actually <laughs> like i do post once a day most days but try i try to post once a day but yeah and then finish my second documentary i didn't do that but only because I changed how I was going to do it. My first documentary was about 46 minutes and I decided that instead of making one long documentary that I was going to split it up into episodes for my YouTube channel. So I'm going to do that in 2020 and start posting an episode of those. Hopefully one a week. I'm going to try. The first episode is done. I just need to, it's almost done. I just have to do some final touches to it and then it'll be done. And my last goal of the year was to to photograph 25 shows I didn't get quite 25 there were days that there were shows that I had opportunities to photograph but either I was too tired because I was working both jobs or I wasn't able to take off one of my jobs or I wasn't able to take time off of either my day job or my night job to shoot the show or there was just days that I just didn't want to go and take photos of it but I did shoot I want to say I at least shot 10 shows this year which is it, not bummed about it I've shot some of my favorite shows this year for since I shot Miss May I last weekend. I photographed Angels and Airwaves a couple weekends ago. Those are two of the, my favorite shows that I shot this year. So I'm not bummed about it. I did shoot some pretty cool shows this year. So yeah. All right. For 2020, I plan to pay off my credit card because having credit card debt is tiring and stressful. So I'm going to make it a goal to pay off my credit card this year. And since I do, I will hopefully have time to skate more this year. Hopefully I'm going to, I plan. It's a goal of mine to learn.
learn five new tricks, whether it be grinds or flips, whatever. I just plan on learning five new tricks this year. And number three, for 2020, I want to start making two videos a week for my YouTube channel. Right now I'm still doing, I still am going to do the one weekly video, but I do eventually want to go up to making two videos a week for my channel. And then number four is to either buy a Sony A7S II just to have as a backup body or a second A7 III, which is what I'm currently using. But right now I take photos with Nikon, but I do eventually want to go full Sony and get rid of my Nikon gear. But I, I'm still trying to decide what second body I want to use as my second shoot second body. I don't know again if I want to get an A7S II or another A7 III, I'm not sure yet. And number five, to be more outgoing this year because I really do want to be able to be more outgoing and we'll see if it happens. I want to be more outgoing this year and I'm going to make it a goal this year as I did last year. Hopefully I can do it and hopefully I can talk to more people. And the final goal that I have this year is to film my first short film. I posted a video a couple a few months ago that I was driving to work one day and I had this video idea and I started writing out a, le a legit script and I want to make the first my first short film and I'm for I'm estimating that it'll probably be like 10 15 minute long video. So, yeah, I want to make my first short film this year. It's just the hardest part is getting the actors and locations down for the type of film that I wrote because some of it requires some interior shots of places that I'm not sure if I'm allowed to shoot in so I need to figure that stuff out before I start filming but it is a goal of mine to start filming this spring slash summer and finish it by the end of 2020. Those were my 2019 goals and my 2020 goals and yeah I know sometimes we make goals whether we know we can accomplish them or we can't accomplish them but just making goals helps me because it gives me a list of things that I know I want to accomplish and it helps me stay motivated to work towards checking those goals off and checking the goals off is a great feeling honestly and I recommend I did I used to have my goals written down on my whiteboard in my office but I had to erase them for something but I recommend physically writing your goals out and somewhere you can see them every day that way it gives you more motivation to work towards them and if you guys have any goals for 2020 I'd love to know what they are drop them down in the comments below and I'd, I'd love to hear about the goals that you guys have made for 2020 so again let drop those down in the comments below and I if you liked what you saw I make videos here every Sunday and as I said earlier in 2020 I plan on making two videos a week so check back for that and I will see you guys next Sunday and whatever the next day is but I hope you guys have had a great Christmas and I hope you guys had a great new year and I'm looking forward to spending 2020 with you guys I'll see you guys next week thanks guys